Bear Grylls. I'm going to show you what it takes to get out alive from some of the most dangerous places on Earth. I've got to make it through a week of challenges in the sort of places you wouldn't last a day without the right survival skills. Now, I'm in Transylvania. A wilderness dominated by thousands of miles of dense forest. It's a domain of ferocious wild bears. That's a brown bear. The going couldn't be tougher through towering ravines and massive cave systems. Just one of the maddest places. I'm going to use every ounce of my knowledge to show you how to survive this vast, rugged landscape. The Transylvania are one of the oldest untouched regions in Europe. The legend of Count Dracula was born here. And if that's not enough, the whole place is just teeming with bears. My crew has spotted a clearing in the forest canopy. We have to be quick. The weather changes fast here, and the pilot can't risk snagging the rope in the trees. As soon as I hit the ground, they're cutting me loose. Good luck, bear! I'm keeping this rope. In this sort of terrain, it could be vital. Okay, get this rope stowed and then get moving. Try and get some blood back into my legs. If you're stranded on high ground, you've got to get down fast. If you can find running water, your chances of survival will increase dramatically. Over half of all human settlements are situated on coasts and riverbanks. If you haven't got a compass, there is actually a way of working out your direction. You know, your north, south, east and west, and just using your watch and the sun. And all you do is get your watch, point the hour hand in the northern hemisphere, point the hour hand directly at the sun, and then halfway between that and the 12 o'clock is south. So south that way, the way I want to go is east that way. Most of Romania's rivers flow into the Danube Delta, about 400 miles east of here. So heading east has got to be your best chance of finding a settlement. Oh. Oh, thanks, man. It's uh, quite a long, long one. Okay. I'm really getting into the forest proper here. It's a pretty extraordinary place to be. It's kind of like having a window back into time. You know, everything here feels just very, very old. Okay, let's keep moving. The forests of the Carpathian Mountains support a huge amount of wildlife, including wolves and lynx. But what I'm more worried about are the bears. 